What's up everybody, this is the fourth year, and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to use my wobble base speed automation technique with the VST Massive. And in this video I'm just going to be um, kind of showing you the difference between Massive and Citrus, which is what I used in the original video. So if you want um, a deeper explanation of how this works, you should watch that video as well either before or after, it doesn't really matter, but um, I'll put that link in the description. Uh, yeah, so first thing is I'm gonna display how it works. This is the layer and that MIDI data in the piano roll controls the wobble speed. <laughs> And then you can also, if you want, just hit notes on your MIDI keyboard to change it while it's playing, instead of having it in the piano roll. And if you have this set up already, it's really easy to link multiple instances of Massive to the same automation. Um, all you need to do is go into the LFO, and make sure you hit the sync button then toggle the bottom one, you want the top one to be one um, otherwise it won't go up to one thirty second which is fast But um, and then once you tweak the bottom you go up to tools last tweaked link to controller and then since it's the XY the X value controlling it you want to link it to that Accept. And then this one I'm layering. And yeah. Oh. Right. Make sure when you do it. that um, remove conflicts is off. I just updated my FL Studio, usually it is off. Uh, but yeah. Okay, so let's see how it works differently from Citrus. So what I'm going to do is put in a new XY controller, um, close that, And uh, okay, so now I'm using this new massive instance, and you want to do the same thing that I did before, put it on the sync instead of the unsynced and have the ratio be 1 to, you know, whatever, and start at 1, 1 to 1, tools, last tweaked, copy value, I don't know, you want the speed all the way, I talked about that in the other tutorial, but uh, then paste the value there, and right click it, create an automation clip. And so you want to do that for you know all of the different values that you plan to use in your song. So if you don't plan to use like 124th, which you know it isn't um an even 4, then you might skip that. But yeah, just go through them all. last tweaked copy value and paste it on and make sure you delete it. I also mentioned that in the other tutorial, the previous automation clip and then create automation clip and the rest is explained in the other video how to get the layer to work so be sure to check that video out as well and I think I'll probably post a template too on the forum I'll have a link to that in the description too. So if you just want um, 
this template with the XY controller already made and then all the values from 1 to 32. So yeah, hopefully you liked that tutorial. Um, I'm going to be doing a lot more, so subscribe if you want more tutorials. And cheers.